This is quite a find. He got a few little scratches on it. The show, show. I don't, I don't get it. clown. It could be clownfish show, fish show. Oh, oh well, clown fish, clown fish shit show. There must be a meaning behind that. OR8398 GP is a 2019-21 uh, North River Seahawk. It's got the top, sides, backdrop, has a merge cover, I think, and a like a cockpit cover that goes to the back. There's a lot of stuff that comes with this boat. Uh, Minnecota, uh, self-deploy. Anchor nav, real nice setup as far as the ladder getting off and on. If you can get out so you don't have to get wet, just go out the bow. I added a little bit of brake fluid to it. Two inch ball, safety chains, round seven. Spare tire, good drainage, rectangle, dual wipers, window stop, gear bath oil hubs, they're good, you don't have to keep taking out the grease gun, brown good, white bad, five lug, they're ST20575R14s, uh, got a radar arch that was built, the Garmin HD, that's the big one, uh, deck lights, when I was in there I couldn't figure out where the power switch was for that. So we're gonna have to look into that. All the trailer lights worked. He got a T99 with 11 by seven pitch prop on it. Total salt water protected, both of these motors. This got Panther steer. Here's the bar. I don't know, I haven't tried, tried it yet, but you can, if you disconnect that bar, you can uh, steer this by hand. And that's probably why he had that. Trim tab, zinc, spray, uh, spray a little corrosion X on that. And that gets all the white off of that. Uh, these got internal zinks, external zinks. Uh, they've been working. That's good. You got a 14 by 15 stainless right hand. Uh, that looks good. And this is a show motor or the VMAX. Uh, they got a lot of power. It's like a 175 basically. Uh, that's the drain for the fish box. That's your main drain. Trim, feed tube, ladder. This here, you don't really need it, but that's what clips this ball, but that's kind of frozen up in there. That's a drain, he must have some kind of a tank hooked up to that, hydraulic steer. He's got Canon electric downriggers, they both work. Your mouth oils are good. Uh, I would get a better antenna. Uh, I'll get rid of this and get me probably, uh, well, this might work pretty good. It's a short one. I like the eight foot fifty two two one or five two two sixes or sevens because they eight foot and they read the whole eight feet. That's the puck for the bow mount. And we'll go back here, flip the ladder, see what we got in here. The pole. I don't know. I that might be in the back. That's kind of stuck on there. They need to free that up. Uh, you got the split box, got the sliders for his tackle, cup holders, the wedge, and everything comes with this boat. So slider, storage box seats, fish box, right here. Then uh, up underneath here, you got a valve back up underneath there. Now he did this for some reason, but this is for his like wash down pumps. Uh, wash down pump and then he got his uh, fish box pump this is just a spare and this is power for something and I'll be damned I don't know uh, put this here there's a battery uh, spray them down with corrosion X I'll tell the guys to do that uh, got the battery charger that's right there the AC just kind of dropped down there that should actually be mounted looks like you put a fairly new switch in there uh, I don't see nothing else. And 10 micron, change that once a year. There's your primer bulb. Then there's his Master uh, Pro, uh, Pro 3 for his kicker. Again, on that battery, I uh, would definitely spray some corrosion X. There's his valve for his pickup. So if you got a leak, you can turn that off. And there's your pump for your wash towel. And then uh, you got a bird heat up seven back there. You wash down there. You're missing the tip off of that. The anchor light needs to be sprayed with corrosion X. It works, but off and on because of the corrosion. There's all these things. I'm not being picky. You know, they call me uh, picky pockets. Well, picky because I'm, I mention everything, you know, and then it's up to them to either fix it or not fix it. That's between them and the customer. But the, the majority, you know, 
your motor's got to run, the, uh, your light's got to work, bilge pump's got to work, all that. But it, say it's some little trinkets like lights or a stereo that was in here didn't work, then sometimes they call you and say, hey, we're not going to do it. All right, here. all pretty good. And then we got seats, straight those down with Trojan X. Uh, oh, yeah, it gets lower. It might be one of them days. Well, it's not down to the second pole yet. And then he's got his batteries up here and then he must have some kind of a light system because i seen the remote controller that's over here for that this here must have been for his phone but i don't know because it's got a switch on it but i don't see no stereo hidden in here unless it's hooked up to them the garments and here's his troll master and this is for the bow mount right here vhf is here and he's got two garmin units here Turn the key on, trim switch, these accessories, I'm not quite sure. I think that's for them lights. One of these are, he added later, but they're not working. So that could just be a, a bad wire. And uh, it's got 50 hours, that's it. Full tank of gas. When they blink, just push those and that stops that. A little suicide knob. So now we're gonna put her in the water and see what she does. I mean, really nice. I mean, this is brand new, basically. Uh, this is Boat Doctor out.